Hi guys, I'd like to share with you today the screen pairing capability of your Samsung phone and other devices, including Samsung TVs. Now I'm gonna demonstrate how to pair your phone to a Samsung TV with Smart View, and I'm also gonna demonstrate how to pair your phone to other TVs that don't have Smart View. On a Samsung TV, scroll over to Connection Guide, and actually it walks you through the steps of how to connect your phone to the TV. Drag down the status bar to open the notification panel and then tap Smart View or Screen Mirroring. Then tap your TV name on the device list to connect to your TV. I'm gonna close this, exit out of it. So I'm about to mirror the screen of my phone onto my TV. So it took a while to discover it, but here you see Samsung 4 Series 24. That's my 24 inch TV right here. This TV I purchased recently for $80 at Walmart. It's a smart TV and has Samsung Smart View built into it. So I'm gonna enable this feature. It says connecting. One really cool thing you can do with your phone once you have it connected is as follows. So I'm gonna go find a movie app real quick. Select this. And I'm actually offline on my phone right now. I do not have service on this phone. And I've got all these shows and movies downloaded. As you can see, my screen is still in the upright orientation that my phone is, but it'll go into landscape mode when you're watching a movie or video with it. So this is streaming, just screen mirroring through the air. It's not on Wi-Fi. There are no cords or anything other than this plug right here for power. And it's literally mirroring the screen. This isn't Chromecast. This isn't Wi-Fi or internet gimmicky things. This is literally the screen being mirrored through the air. And this is sort of new technology to me, so I'm really excited about it. Really live a very minimalistic life as far as expenses go. Utilities, internet, and cable. I was able to cut those cords. Maybe you don't have a Samsung TV, but you have a Samsung smartphone and you want to use Smart View on another TV. There's something called Screen Beam. As you can see up here, I've got Screen Beam attached to the back of my device. And these are about $60. And this is a non-smart TV. So I'm about to demonstrate the utility of being able to use Smart View on a TV that doesn't have it using the HDMI port. So I'm gonna connect in just the same way that I did with the other TV, but it's gonna say something else. So here I see Screen Beam 2. That's what I named my Screen Beam when I took it out of the box and programmed it. The difference being is that you're using an, an external device over here, which does basically the same thing. And I can still watch movies on my phone offline that are downloaded or ones over your internet immediately. It comes on the screen immediately. You can adjust the picture on your phone. This is the best way to utilize the full potential of your Samsung Galaxy. And in my opinion, this totally sets it apart from the iPhone and other phones that are that even claim to be in the, the same class as the Samsung Galaxy line. I'm going to do another video on why I think Samsungs are better than iPhones, but for now, I just wanted to give you a little bit of a tutorial and understanding of Smart View, and I, I think a lot of people probably don't understand what it is. It is not over Wi-Fi. It has nothing to do with internet. It's mirroring your screen wirelessly from your phone to another device, which to me, this is simply incredible technology. So have fun and enjoy watching your phone screen on bigger screens now. Take care.